Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited because I got so much positive feedback and people just wanting to know more about my experiences with spirit or paranormal or whatever you want to call it. So um, I have another story for you. I was sitting in my den and my husband and I, we were watching The Tonight Show or something on TV and I started feeling, you know, this was a couple of months after my dad passed away and I started feeling how it felt when he was in the room. So the only thing I can really kind of compare it to is, you know when you're almost awake and you're, you're sleeping you know, with your significant other or if you have a roommate or whatever, you know when that person enters a room or not you, before you open your eyes and see them. Like you pretty much can just sense that they're there or not. Whether you pick it apart or not, that's really what it is. You're sensing their energy in the room or not. So getting back to the story, I started sensing that my dad was around. I started getting the same feeling that when he was here. And I said, you know what? I think my dad's here. And my husband, Chris, said, I think I saw something green flash in the corner of the room. And so I just lifted up my phone and I said, if you're here, Dad, can you show your light? And, it, and he did. And so I really believe it was my dad because he gave me that feeling. And that's what I am learning to discern who and what spirit is by the way they make me feel. So it's kind of, I'm kind of learning as I go here because I haven't found anybody that is, can really make sense of a lot of And I have to say that I have seen my dad after he had passed and it's a really crazy story. Um, we were sitting in Chili's and just eating and that was our thing. Like my dad would show up and we would all go out to eat. We'd have drinks and it was fun. And we'd do that every, at least six times a month. I mean, everybody would just meet up. That's how my family was. And my dad would always like, hey, where y'all at tonight? We'll meet y'all. And so we were sitting in Chili's and I could see, I don't know if you've been or not, but in the South we have a Chili's and you can come in one door then you go through a second door and that's where the hostess greets you. It was around four o'clock in the afternoon, so it's not really that busy, but we were waiting for a few other people to get there. And me and my husband and my kids and their friends, and we were all just having a great time eating dip. We had been there for like an hour. And I looked up and I saw my dad in those two doorways before he got to the hostess. And he looked and smiled at me and I just said, hey, come on, we're sitting over here, come on. And in that moment, not one inkling of me said, oh my God, that's my dad and he's passed away already and I'm looking at him. I never felt, saw that or anything, I, I, nothing. It was just like normal, every time he would meet us type of thing. So I said, yeah. Come on, I waved to him and he walked through the door and I saw him standing there and the hostess never ever greeted him. And this happened within seconds. And I, I looked down and I looked at my husband and I said, I cannot believe, did you just see that? And he said, yes. And I looked up, I mean, it, we looked up, we looked away and he was gone. And the hostess and nobody greeted him. So I guess they didn't see him. But I looked at my husband and said, can you believe this just happened? Because I just forgot he had passed away. And that kind of like irritated me that, wow, you know, here I saw him and I didn't even realize that he had passed in that moment. And I honestly just believe that that was his way of saying, you know, hey, I'm still here, and this, that, and the other, but I thought it was really cool. But after that, I asked Spirit, and I asked God, if you're going to give me this gift, please do not let me see people in 3D anymore, or that's what I call them, 3D, like real person, because I don't know, I just didn't like that, that feeling. So, 
I said a light orb I can handle. So maybe that's why I'm getting light orbs all the time now instead of actual full figured body spirits. So yes, I, I saw, I, I felt my dad in my den and he came through with a green light and I thought that was really cool. So now I don't feel alone and feel like he's gone so much because I do sense his spirit and I have caught it on tape. And I think that that gives us human people a visual thing to look at so we don't feel so alone. And when that happens, the grieving doesn't turn into depression. So I really think depression comes from loneliness, but that's a whole other story. I don't, I'm not a doctor, but I just feel that way. If you'd like to hear some more stories and you want to hear some, see some more clips of the spirits and everything, or you want to ask me anything that I've gone through, maybe you're going through, um, shoot me a comment. I love reading y'all's private messages. I love it. So just keep on flowing and keep the stories coming. I love it. So just give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because that makes a difference. Thanks. Bye. See y'all.